Fan blog Latte. Hello, my name is Gary. And guess who stayed out late at open mic night again tonight? Yeah, you know. Well, I would apologize. Except, no, I wouldn't apologize because it's late. But let's be real, I would have done direct upload anyway. And it's. I think it's. In some ways, it's really hard, but I also think that overall, it's really good that I've been going to Jive, um, which is the name of the coffee shop, open mic night every week, and, um, because at first, the first couple times I remember, it was just, and sometimes still, and not necessarily for this, but just stuff in general, I've just sort of had to, like, kind of push myself to do stuff, and not that, like, it's not okay for me to have alone time at home, because it totally is, and I need a certain amount of that as well, but it's also, I think I've just been doing that all the time, and not going out, and not seeing people, and not doing things, and that just was not healthy, and I just really had to, like, just push myself to do stuff lately, which is, I don't know, weird, I guess, because... I never, I guess, maybe, I guess it depends on what it is, but normally things like this, like going to open mic nights and shows like that would, would not be something I would have to drag myself to, and even when, even when I have felt like I've dragged myself to it, I've always, I've always been glad that I did, I've always, you know, ended up having a good time, and been like, yeah, it was good for me to get out of the house or whatever, and I've been making myself get out and doing, like, making plans and doing stuff a whole lot more the last, like, month or two, or, like, month, I mean, not even a whole month, the last few weeks, and it's, I don't know, in one way, I'm, in, like, in one way, I'm a lot more tired, because I'm, I'm, like, out a lot more, um, but in another way, I think, you know, my life is feeling like it's more than just work and Netflix, and I think that that's good, but, yeah, and I also think it's part of getting through the struggle, because I can't just wallow forever, you know, like, wallowing for a while is okay, but you've gotta, you gotta just get up and do stuff, so, anyway, ha. <sighs> I've missed your videos. I know that Sharon and me and Karis have kind of been the only ones posting videos lately. Kat had a few for a while, and then I don't, I don't know what's up with Claire, but not you, Claire, other Claire. Um, I miss that was my sister. In case you couldn't hear, she was like, "Come here." Uh, anyway, I miss videos from you guys. I miss your faces been missing a lot of things, a lot of people lately. I miss traveling with Karis, I miss VidCon with Kat and everyone else, and yeah, so, but yeah, anyway, today is awesome because, uh, today is the first official day of the, like, the full launch of the Christmas and holiday stuff at Starbucks, um, which we've had the drinks and the red cups for, like, two weeks, but the, like, the merch and the wearing red aprons and everything didn't really start till today. Today was the first day, and, um, this year, my boss is letting us bend the dress code, um, so that, like, pretty much if it's in any way Christmassy, she's gonna let us wear it to work, so that, that includes Santa hats, uh, reindeer antlers, it means that I can wear red and green and possibly gold instead of black and white and brown at work, uh, which is great, and she even said, if I wore a red t-shirt, it doesn't even have to be colored, so it's not just colors, it's like pretty much whatever, so I wore green pants to work today, and my red apron, and it was just, I don't know, it just makes things more fun, because you can only do it for a short amount of time, and it gives me a little bit more creativity in my, in my work place, I guess, so, yeah, that's why today's awesome, and,
Oh, 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 also, I'm going to Seattle on Saturday for four days to visit to scout out the train. Um, I feel like I told you guys this. To scout out the train for when I'm, you know, to see, like, what part I want to live in and et cetera, et cetera. And it's going to be good, and I'm excited. Um, but, yeah, I just pray for, like, smooth travels and also that, I guess, you know, because this is going to be a trip that's going to be determining some things as far as my move, that just think things would, I guess, fall into place. Just really pray that this trip is, like, would be what I need it to be, I guess. So, yeah, and I'm almost at six minutes. Ugh. Anyway, um, I love you all. And, Karis, I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye.